Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use expressions and uh, some arithmetic operators, uh, how to calculate things like square root using the exponent function or the square of a number, uh, you know, the power of 2, the power of 3, or square root would be to the power of half, and so on and so forth. So let's calculate the area of the triangle given its three sides. Uh, using the formula that we have here. First, we find the semi-parameter of the triangle, which would be a plus b plus c divided by 2, where a, b, and c are the three sides of a triangle. And then we find the area, which would be the square root of this whole expression. So first, we get the input, the three sides from the user. So let's say a equals, and remember how we took our input and converted it to an integer. So let's say input please enter side 1 or let's say please enter length of side 1 and notice how if I miss a parenthesis it gets indented telling me that there is something missing there so two parentheses to close it b equals int open parenthesis input of please enter side length of side 2 colon and then I am going to copy that whole thing and use it for c and change this to c equals Please enter the length of side 3. So once we have the three sides, now let's use our single line comment and say calculate um, semi parameter s equals a plus b plus c slash 2. And then using that, we calculate area. So area equals and our expression would be s times for the asterisk to multiply within parentheses s minus a times within parentheses s minus b within parentheses s minus c and then we want to put the whole thing inside parentheses because this is the square root is for the whole expression and a double a asterisk says we are going to do to the power of 0.5 so that's the exponent two asterisks will say we're going to do the power of the number and I say 0.5 so it's to the power of half so that will calculate the area then we say print that to the user area of the triangle equals and you close quote comma area which is the variable itself so now let's save this file and let's run it oh it says there's something wrong somewhere um oh i should say print and there's two parentheses notice i don't want two i only want one let's run it again and save it and now it says enter length of side here, do 4, let's try 5 and 6, and you get this area, which is a very long number. So now if we want to format it to two decimals, so you come here and say area of the triangle equals, and you put percent 0.2f inside of the quote, and outside of that you take away the comma, and you add a percent sign outside before the variable to let it know that it's formatted. So make sure that there is no comma there. Now save it and then run it again. And we'll try the same 4, 5, and 6. And this time we get 9.92. And you can add some units to that if you want to, to say square units for the area or whatever it is. Or you can try 0.3 to see how you get three decimal places. Um, so we've learned a couple of different things. You can try and apply some of these things to your assignment number three.